The robotics officer reports that the uh, trigger has been pulled by Nyberg and the snares are open. This view from the camera on the latching end effector of the arm, you can see the movement of the shadow they indicate that the uh, HTV and its uh, target apparatus in our field of view slowly changing its orientation from the camera itself. HTV is now slowly drifting out of the capture envelope, slowly drifting away from the Canada Arm 2. Release took place as scheduled at 11.20 Central Time this morning. And the uh, Canada Arm 2 has now been commanded to move away from HTV 2. Visiting vehicle officers reporting to the flight director that HTV has a very slight roll rate well within uh, the expected what they would see here. You yes, sir. And now, Kong Space to Ground 2. I have HTV retreat commanded and T timer started. And Houston copies all. Good work. The visiting vehicle officer also now reporting that the roll rate is back to zero. The vehicle is uh, correcting its attitude and is holding as planned. HTV release uh, right on the rescheduled time of 11.20 Central Time this morning as the International Space Station flew above uh, central Algeria. Here's the view from a camera on the station's starboard side truss looking back. A range of uh, nine meters now between the uh, arm and uh, the HTV. It's going to be allowed to slowly drift away from the station for five minutes before the first uh, planned uh, separation maneuver. Just over four minutes now since the release of uh, the HTV from the uh, International Space Station's Canada Arm 2. Out at a range now of about uh, 23 meters from the station. Release went uh, without any issues. The uh, Karen Nyberg commanded the release of the uh, snares and the latching end effector. HTV began to drift back. She then commanded the arm to uh, withdraw and to move away from HTV.
and Station Houston. The IDM-1 maneuver is complete. Please perform step number three in 1.602. And uh, while I have you, I'd like to say to uh, you guys, uh, Karen, Luke, and the rest of the E-36 crew, as well as to our entire HTV-4 family and team, great work and congratulations for a very successful conatory mission so far. We could not have hoped for a better mission. HTV still has a few more days to go, so good luck. Kuno tori wa nimotsu dake dewa naku taksan no hito no kibo mo hakon dekure mashita no kori no mission mo kabata kudasai. Congratulations to the entire team and thanks so much. Uh, we we got a lot of supplies and hardware and science up from HTV and also some fresh fruit. We really appreciate it and. Um, Best of luck to HTV on her return. A live look at the uh, HTV flight control team at the uh, Japanese uh, control center in uh, Scuba, Japan. It's just outside of Tokyo. Uh, seeing the same live views from the station that uh, we are and uh, seeing no problems with any of the systems on board the HTV. There have been no reports of any issues. HTV is now uh, just shy of 39 meters away from the station. The opening rate is uh, picked up slightly to uh, 0.07 meters uh, per second. <laughs> 